Well, after just discussing this with a friend, the news is out. I just found out that Brett D. Hitman Hart has signed a deal with the WWE that will go into effect on January 1st, 2010. This is big news and as a genuine Bret Hart fan, Bret Hart is one of my main favorites of all time. Perhaps my last favorite by Hart that I really, really supported, supported whatever he did, whether he was a face or heel or no matter what. He was actually the first wrestler that I followed as a kid not buying the heel or face thing anymore because when he turned heel in 1997 I still supported the man I just he was my favorite that's all I have to say and I couldn't be happier I'm so excited about this this is really really unique however we do not know what his agenda will be why has he signed a deal with the WWE could be for various reasons. Bret Hart has earlier stated um, a couple of years ago and since leaving the WWE in 1997 following the Montreal screw job that he will never set foot again inside a WWE ring. He has actually said that. He also decided in 2006 when he was introduced and inducted into the Hall of Fame he chose not to show up at WrestleMania the following night due to not feeling comfortable about it. However, the news is out, he has signed a deal with the WWE that goes uh, into effect on January 1st, 2010, that's just a couple of weeks away, and apparently it's a short-term contract that goes from January 1st to somewhere right after WrestleMania 26. What does this, what does this mean? It could mean a lot of things. It could mean that on January 4th, when we will have TNA going head to head with the WWE Monday Night Raw with Hulk Hogan debuting on TNA Impact that Bret the Hitman Hart will indeed be the special guest host on this very night he has been rumored on being the special guest host this night along with The Rock me personally this shooter would love to see Bret Hart way more than to see The Rock this very night that would be way more unique as already said by, said by other shooters shooters here on YouTube Bret Hart has not been in the WWE shown up on WWE TV since 1997 with the Hall of Fame induction ceremony excluded that's that's just off the charts it doesn't get more unique than that that will itself cause for huge ratings that very night there will not be a soul, not a single wrestling fan would want to miss that out. No way. Could it be, however, that the deal signed until right after WrestleMania could intend for Bret Hart to actually play in a role at WrestleMania? There have been rumors out earlier that Vince and Bret Hart should have a match. Whether, whether Bret Hart is physically able to have a match, I am not sure. A street fight could somewhat cover that up. Or it's neither of this. It's neither of Bret Hart being a special guest host or having a match making a, an appearance at WrestleMania. It could be that they are just looking to produce. There is rumors that they're now trying to looking forward to produce a new DVD featuring Bret Hart and covering the Hart Foundation and the history of that very faction from the old days with Bret the Hitman Hart and Jim Neidhart till 1997 where also British Bulldog and Hart and Brian Pillman were included. Uh, Jim Neidhart recently did interviews apparently with the WWE to have on that very DVD and now it could be that it is Bret Hart's turn to do that very same thing and that this is just a DVD project contract. Or it could be all three or it could be something completely else but the news are out. Bret the Hitman Hart has signed a contract with the WWE and to me to this shoot shooter that could be nothing but good news thank you for watching and simply have a great day because this is a great day for wrestling